Hi, I'm Dr. Mark Price, the sports medicine doctor at Mass General and the team doctor for the New England Patriots. And I'm Jim Whalen, head athletic trainer for the New England Patriots, and this is your Mass General Patriots health tip of the day. Shoulder instability is a very common injury that affects many overhead and contact athletes. In shoulder instability, the shoulder comes out of the socket, either subtly, something called a subluxation, or all the way out, called a dislocation. This can be for either traumatic or repetitive type injuries. If it's the case that it continues to come out and is bothersome, oftentimes either surgery or a rehab program will be recommended. Jim's going to tell you a little bit about the rehab that we do for shoulder instability. Joining us today from Foxborough High School is Brendan. Brendan is going to show us some exercises for shoulder instability. The very first exercise is shoulder internal rotation where he will move the resistance band towards his body. He'll do three sets of 10 of this exercise. The next exercise is external rotation where he moves the arm out from his body. Again on this, it's three sets of 10. As we progress on in the rehabilitation, we move to rhythmic stabilization. This exercise, the patient is providing stabilization as I'm trying to move the arm in different planes of motion. One of the later stage exercises we have are physio ball push-ups. Go ahead, Brendan. And those are several exercises we do to provide stability to the shoulder. Now not all episodes of instability in the shoulder require surgery and it's important to discuss with the doctor whether or not your symptoms warrant surgery or can be treated without surgery. But the right combination of surgery, rehab, and if necessary post-operative care can produce great patient outcomes. And that's your Mass General Patriots Health Tip of the Day.